Live from Los Angeles, welcome back to Good Morning All Land. In these times, it's all about collaboration, and Laura Flipowitz has mastered that. She's the CEO and founder of the Connect Her Media Collaborative Agency. Mm. Very cool. Yes. Very Lots clever name, too. I know, right? Thank yeah. you. Tell us about what that is. Um, so what we do is, I mean, I've been doing this for more than 10 years, so I kind of started in the social media space um, before it was popular, yeah. I guess, right? Kind of dating myself there a little bit. but um, My space. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but basically, um, we're an agency that works with uh, Gen Zers, which is, you know, the, the teens and tweens of today, the Gen Alpha generation, and mom uh, social media influencers. So we collaborate with brands and projects and create our own projects. Um, and bring in different elements of everyone's expertise to create one big event or one big project or campaign or But you've whatever. been recognized as a top blogger, one of the best moms in SoCal to follow. How have you really established that voice for yourself? I established that for myself just, you know, because I'm a mom, right? So, you know, before I was a mom, I used to have a completely different life, right? Yeah. <laughs> um, but then I sort of reinvented myself during that time and kind of focused in on the mom aspect um, of still being able to be a mom at home with my kid and also still kind of having my own independence as who I am and who I went to school for and, you know, all of that. So but let's go a little deeper here for a second. Okay. Let's let's talk about your your cancer survivor. No, my mom is. Your mom is. Yes. I what am, was that like for you and she, like helping her through that journey? Yeah, so she um, is, a, is a, you know, cancer survivor, knock on wood, yes. right, everywhere. Yes. Um, but um, so I really pull from her strength to do everything that I do because I feel that she, you know, gave me the power to know that anything is possible, mm -hmm. um, even when she was stage four at the time. And now mm -hmm. she's, you know, in remission, yay. Mm -hmm. um, but in my own struggle, actually, I had a brain tumor. And so... Mm -hmm. I kind of pulled from that strength as well and got through that. And I sort of self-diagnosed it when everybody told me I didn't have anything. Really? Um, so I said, no, I do have something and you're going to look in my head. <laughs> how, did you, wow. how did you know I that? You know, you just have, I'm very in, like in tune with me, right? Mm -hmm. That's super important. A lot of people are not. Um, and I just kept feeling, feeling like a little like pinch or prickle up here. And I was like, you know, that's not normal. Um, and so I said, there's something there. And uh, first time they did it, they said, there's nothing there. And I still disagreed. So a year later, I went back and they said, yeah, you know, there is something there. And in two weeks, you have to go in for like mm. a piece of your, you know, skull wow. to be taken out. Essentially. Mm. So that's wow. such an important yeah, so, message, though, to really listen to your own intuition about absolutely. your body. For anything, you know, I mean, mm -hmm. health or, you know, if you have an idea as a mom, you know, you just have to go for it and know that that's possible. Right. And once you go through all of these type of like real problems, right? Yeah. Um, everything else seems so easy. And when there's, you know, drama, you hear people saying it really doesn't matter. Right. Like I really have no time so, for that. So clearly. what is your mission with all this? What would you say your mission is? My mission is, um, you know, our, our real big focus right now is on the next generation. I actually have a 13, almost 14 year old. She'll be 14 on Saturday. Mm. Um, but, uh, you know, they are sort of like our future. So I think my whole mission has now shifted to the Gen Z Social Summit and um, creating a social media educational program through the summit and in partnership with a lot of companies and organizations to help them understand that they can use social media for good, yes. right? Um, they have so much at their fingertips at mm -hmm. this point in time, much more than we ever had. Um, and I think it's important for them to say, this is not something that I want to be associated with, and this is something I should, and yeah. let's create a positive digital footprint yes. for myself. Yes, yes. Right? Yeah. That's so important. so important. So important. And yeah, I mean, we're, people are addicted to social media. We all are. And if we're going to do that, we're, we might as well be intentional and use it for what we do want to create and what we do want to in, in, you know, consume, for yes. sure. And it really is just a just switching the mind and deciding and just going right. for it. And partnerships, who you, mm -hmm. who you partner, you know, and they are so influential to even the younger generation, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So, you know, they're watching what you're doing. If you're doing something that's not appropriate or, you know, something that's not right, they might follow in those footsteps. So they, they have a social responsibility to kind of become that role model yeah. for people that are, you know, not just locally, but worldwide. Yeah, mm -hmm. I love it. Well, tell people how they can work with you, how they can follow you. 
Um, so they can find me at connectformedia.com um, and the Gen Z Social Summit will be in Atlanta, um, partnered with Great Wolf Lodge um, and in Los Angeles as well. Nice. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Stay tuned. We'll be right back.